activist industry had made great hay about linking pesticides and uh, in, in particular neonics to die-offs of bees and they started fundraising campaigns. Sierra Club had it, you know, save the bees and what was on in the picture? A big donate button in green because that's how right. you save the bees. You donate to the Sierra Club. It was the single biggest money raising uh, campaign and I would say scam in the, in the last 25 years. And then you get Time Magazine yes. um, in 2013. World Without Bees was the cover story. What was fascinating in reading the article is that there was not one interview with an entomologist. Imagine that. Guess what happened in March? Uh, an editor from Vox Magazine, who just happened to be the guy who wrote the article for Time Magazine back in 2013, had a big, a big headline article saying, Mia Copa. I got it wrong. I was seduced by, by environmentalist propaganda. There has never been a bee crisis. I misreported it. I, I went to the wrong sources. Little by little over the past five years, that, I, that uh, view has collapsed. And yet, if you go out and you ask the public right now, 80% of people still believe that, um, that neonicotoids and, and, and other um, harm bees.